We are on zombie patrol today. And by that, I mean I'm the zombie and I will be patrolling through this theater. Oh my god, I am so tired this morning. I was laying in bed, couldn't get to sleep, couldn't get to sleep, couldn't get to sleep. All of a sudden it was like, I feel so sick and drunk that I'm going to immediately pass out. It was great, love that. Um, unfortunately, that I, I would have been fine with it if it had come like a couple hours earlier, but no, I, I don't know what time it was because my ring wasn't actually charged enough to tell me and track my sleeping, but I am really tired, if nothing else. <laughs> it's currently just before eight. I walked into the theater and like, come in the theater, go through the green room, come up into the lobby and on my way, turn on all the lights. And I was like halfway through the lobby to where I put my stuff down before I realized, oh, I should probably turn on the lights. <laughs> also, it's like sunny, but trying to rain. And I'm supposed to go hang out with my friend today. And the problem is it rained overnight. <laughs> so I was like, it's gonna rain, we're fine. So I didn't bring shoes that would be acceptable to walk on trails with. So I hope it rains. <laughs> Anyways, I am here. My nose ring is doing its thing. And I'm gonna have my breakfast string. Hopefully that will like imbue some life into me. And then we're gonna get to work. I think I should actually see some people today because Wednesday is a tech day. Um, although I did get a text from one of my techs yesterday saying, hey, I'm not coming in today because I have stingy watery eyes and a sore throat. <laughs> Normally I'd come in, but <laughs> so I don't know if he'll be in, but there should be at least two, well, one other person? No, two, there's gotta be at least two. If he's not coming in, probably three because it is a recording day. It's coming back to me. My brain is very slow functioning this morning. Also, I wore this sweater when I went to the dog's house and I probably shouldn't have because I think I'm having an allergic reaction to the dog that was left on it. Well, hello, I am home. It is uh, three o'clock, so work was pretty good there were a lot of people there today there was like four techs plus the managing director plus a front of house staff plus me so that was a lot so i was certainly avoiding people as much as i could <laughs> and then my grandma texted me and was like oh are you at work are you up at noon i was like yeah but i have plans and she's like okay i'll be there soon and i'm like why <laughs> and then um she walked over from her place because she lives really close now that she moved and um She's like talking to me and I'm like, yeah, grandma, like, it's great to see you, but I'm literally being paid to work right now and I'm talking to you and I have stuff to do. So <laughs> that was funny. And then um, I found out that the show today was canceled, which means I don't have to go in tomorrow, which is so exciting because that means I can sleep in. Oh, I just, I didn't get a lot of sleep with the puppies because um, of pills and stuff and I just wanted more sleep. Um, so that's exciting. I'm very jazzed about having a free day tomorrow, which was completely unexpected. And then my friend picked me up and we went and we got some, we got some Timmy's. He got Timbits, I got a croissant and we got drinks and we went to the beach and we just sat there and chatted for a while. And then we started driving around and then we went and got onion rings and more drinks. <laughs> And then just drove around some more. It was, it was nice. It was great. It was good to see him again because, you know, I went a whole week without seeing him. And, um, yeah, I'm home now. I'm trying to decide if I want to have, like, a quick lay down because uh, I am a little sleepy. But then on the other hand, I'm like, I probably shouldn't nap. But we'll see. I don't know. I think I'm just going to putter for a bit and, and do what feels best. So that's where we're at. And then later today, I don't know, man. I feel like I want to do things. I'm almost at the point where I want to start editing vlogs again, which is nice because I think I probably have five or six <laughs> backlogged. <laughs> so that'd be a good thing to get to eventually. I'm not quite there yet, but I am getting there. So that is good. But for now, like I said, I think I'm just going to chill. Maybe embroider later. We'll see. I don't know. Alrighty. So I had a bit of a lay down and just watched some YouTube and did nothing. And then I had a little snack <laughs> and now it is just after five and I think I am legitimately losing it because so I use Artlist for my music. Is this blurry? I think that's blurry, isn't it? I don't like that. <laughs> BRB. There, that's better. Okay. Anyways, I use Artlist for my music um, because I found I use Filmora to edit and it does have a free library, but I found that I just felt stifled by it. And so I got Artlist, which I got in November or December last year, and I love it. Love it. It's pricey. It just drooled all over myself. It's a little bit pricey, but compared to other services, 
the price is comparable and also the main difference is because I was looking at Epidemic and I was looking at film at um, oh, Artlist, that's what it's called. And the biggest difference is with Epidemic at the end of your subscription, if you don't have an active subscription anymore, while all your content that you previously used still has a license, you can no longer use that music that you downloaded. So like, say you have a subscription for like two years and then you stop having a subscription, then you just have to delete all that music because you don't have a license for it anymore. Artlist, on the other hand, you can keep and use that music forever. So like, <laughs> I'm getting to a point, I promise. So initially I got Artlist, I'm like, okay, I'm just gonna have it for the one year, but having it for six months now, I am like, I love Artlist and they're constantly adding new music and I'm not sponsored. <laughs> paying for this with my own money, but I just love it and I think it's great. But here's where the me losing my mind moment came from. So I got an email saying, hey, would you like to fill out a survey for Artlist? And I was like, you know what? You guys, the real homies, I'm gonna fill out a survey. And so I was, and I got to, <laughs> I got to the thing where it's like, are you a content creator, blah, blah, this, what level, whatever. And then the next one was like, how many views do you have on your content? And it was like less than a thousand. I clicked on that and I just giggled for the rest of the time. And then everything else was really funny for some reason. So I think I'm losing it, but time will tell. <laughs> I think what I'm going to do today, I, I, while I was laying in bed chilling, um, my thought process went to, I think I'm going to embroider. I'm just not sure what yet. So we'll get there. <laughs> I was looking at the yellow pants that I got yesterday. I was like, mm-hmm, I should embroider a frog on those. <laughs> Haven't even worn them once. Should embroider a frog. But I don't actually have stabilizers, so I can't really embroider on clothes. Otherwise, I would definitely be embroidering on clothes. So we'll figure out what we're doing. <laughs> and then I think I'm just going to continue my uh, MCU watch through. Um, I am on Iron Man 2. Again, we had the little blips where we watched Ant-Man because it's just a really funny, sh funny movie. And we watched Doctor Strange and missed Captain Marvel. But now we're good. We've gone <laughs> Captain America, First Avenger, Captain Marvel. Is it called Captain Marvel? I'm sure it's called Captain Marvel. Iron Man 1. We're on to Iron Man 2. I think Thor is next. Um, I'm really excited to get to Thor Ragnarok because it was a very funny one too. So anyways, <laughs> losing it, rambling. But you know, generally, feeling pretty good. <laughs> this is so bright. I have been doing a lot of sitting and my like low, my like mid back down to my butt and hips just hurt because I, since the last time I picked up the camera, I've just been sitting here embroidering. Um, I decided to work on something that I drew months ago. <laughs> And um, it kind of changed the design a little bit too, uh, but we're working on it. Haven't decided the fill level that I'm going to do, but I will show you. It's a bag and it's this little kitty cat with the um, flower crown. I'm getting rid of this part because I'm just going to do an all black cat and I, I'm not going to fill in the cat because that would take forever. Um, I'm probably going to fill in the flower crown, but I haven't decided yet. And it kind of makes me want to fill in the ears, but if I fill in the ears, then I'll have to fill in the black part of the ears. And then that's like a rabbit hole I don't want to go down or a bunny hole. No, this is, this is a cat. I meant to be witty and call it a cat hole and I failed miserably. Anyways, and then I still have to do the eyes, but we're working. We got the yellow here for the next set of colors. We've got the colors we're working with here. And then as always happens, <laughs> the embroidery floss everywhere. It doesn't typically look as bad when I make my bed because I can kind of keep it a little bit more organized, but right now it's just kind of everywhere. And then <laughs> I, I move that so that it, the cord reaches and it's the most comfortable as can be, but uh, I should maybe like figure out how to hook up Bluetooth headphones to my big computer because it'd just be so much easier, I think. I think I'm probably going to work on this for a little bit longer, but I am losing not interest, just steam. I'm losing steam. Um, I'm on to the Avengers. So I finished watching Iron Man 2. This will give you a <laughs> kind of marker for how long I've been sitting here. So I was like at the climax of Iron Man 2 basically. So I've watched that, watched, finished watching that, watched all of Thor and I am about an hour into the Avengers. So I've been here for quite some time short of like stopping to eat food at one point. So yeah, we're not gonna be doing this for much longer and then we'll uncover the bed and then it'll probably be bedtime, hopefully. Hopefully I can get to sleep, get to get a little bit of a sleep in tomorrow, I think. 
I, I told my friend I was off tomorrow if he wanted to hang out, but he has not texted me, so I'm assuming at least not early, so that's cool. Anyways, I'm gonna go, because otherwise I'm gonna keep rambling and just continue on this little kitty cat. Meow. <laughs> oh, is that too blown out? I think it's okay. Alrighty, well, it is the end of the night. It is 10 to 12. I uh, embroidered for a little bit longer. I finished watching The Avengers, and, um... Now I'm gonna try to go to sleep. So with that, I will see you in the morning. <laughs> Good night. Good morning. I look a little rough, <laughs> but it's because I woke up because I had to go to the bathroom, and then I was like, oh, I should check to see if like my friend texted me or anything to see if I need to get moving. It's like 10:20. I was like, I'm feeling pretty awake. I woke up on my own. Like I'm probably okay to stay up. And so I checked my phone and I had a text saying that I could register for my first dose of the vaccine. Exciting. It's still like, what is today? <laughs> it's still like two weeks away basically, but I'm so excited. My hair is so excited too. Oh, I was so concerned that I wouldn't be able to register for my first dose before I went out to Blind Child in the summer and I was so stressed about having to um, come out during the summer because obviously it's important to get a vaccine um, because the more people that get it, the less chance it's going to spread, the less chance it's going to mutate, and the better chance we have of getting back to a normal life and getting ahead of this. So, I'm so excited. <sighs> but yeah, so that's where we're at. I literally just woke up. Like, I'm still rubbing sleep out of my eyes. This, obviously, is a situation. <laughs> I can rarely sleep with my hair down, and especially not when it's hot in my room. So, there. Oh, no. I think it's worse. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to continue to wake up and then probably either make something to eat or just have a breakfast drink because I'm lazy. And then we will see what I have. I don't know what I'm going to do today. I'm just, I'm so excited. I just started the day on such a good note. <laughs> so I decided to get all cute and put on a dress today because yesterday when I talked to my friend and asked him if like, I really let him know I was off, so if he wanted to hang out, we could do that. And then I texted him this morning, tell him I was getting my vaccine, and he wasn't like, hey, let's hang out. So I was like, okay, cool, so I'll, like, I'll just put on my cute dress and have a good time. And then he texted me like 10 minutes ago to be like, hey, are you free? And so I think we're going to go try to do frisbee golf, so I could, I could do that in a dress, but I think I'd rather be more comfortable. So I'm going to change into some shorts and a shirt because it is supposed to get up to like 22 degrees today, I think. Let's check what it's at right now. It is currently at 17 degrees, so yeah, we want to be comfy. And while yes, this is very comfy and breezy, I don't think it'll be great for the um, the frall thing. So maybe I'll wear this shirt. It's pretty thick, so we'll see, but I'm gonna wear a new pair of shorts. And um, yeah, I'm just excited about the weather. could drive along an ocean reflecting the sun or make a bed of green atop a wide open scene under a canvas of blue i would draw ever nearer to you to feel the dew on your skin that is how it would begin for summer is for falling Alrighty, so I am home now. I end up going with this shirt and a pair of shorts. Um, this shirt is growing on me. Again, don't love it. Like, love, love, love it. But we'll see. <laughs> Anyways, it is currently 20 to 5. So we went out frolfing. <laughs> um, I did terribly. I mean, I did about how I expected. So it was a par 3 on each hole. And I averaged about 4 on each hole. So I was about 19 over, I would guess. Like I didn't actually keep track, but that would be my thoughts, <laughs> which is fine. <laughs> it was, my friend was really nice because he has, well, he has three discs because he has a putter. And then he has one that's like a 1.8 bank to the one side. So he took that one and he gave me the straight one, which was great because I was banking to that side all the time anyways. But I definitely like to go out and do that again because it was lots of fun and it was a beautiful day too. I have a bit of a headache, which I think might be 
sun related. Um, I did put on sunscreen, which is nice, but I probably need to drink water because I've only had like 500 mils today. So I should probably increase that intake. And then I had to go to the store because I need to get more allergy medicine uh, because although in like an amazing turn of events, I didn't have to take allergy medicine last night before bed. So maybe it's getting better. So got some more allergy medicine though, because I was about to run out, picked up one and two tank tops. I really like these tank tops. I think I'm going to get rid of all the other tank tops I have though, because I've been keeping ones that I've just been keeping to have tank tops. Now I have four good new ones. And then I got this pair of like sweatpants that are like kind of dressy looking sweatpants. So that's cute. Maybe I can wear them to work and no one will know. <laughs> um, yeah, so that's where we are at. And um, I think I'm gonna maybe get back to embroidering here for a bit. Definitely gonna drink some water. I'm gonna chug the rest that's in my bottle. Oh, it's probably, you know what? That's not a liter, that's only 750 mils. So I, I've had like 300 mils of water today. So I'm gonna chug that and then I'm gonna fill it up and then I'm gonna chug it again. And then hopefully that will help with the headache. <laughs> Alrighty, well, it is 20 to nine. I'm a little red. I think I maybe got too much sun today. And also I have a massive headache. It just won't stop. <laughs> I've been drinking lots of water. I think this is like my fourth one since I picked up the camera last. So that is exciting at least. Um, it looks so blue. <laughs> That's better, maybe. Anyways, um, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna embroider for a little bit longer. I started filling in these flowers. I think I might have to outline them once I um, finish, so we will see. Um, I did finish watching Thor Dark World, so that's exciting. Um, I'm on to Iron Man 3, I believe, so I'm gonna put that on. Embroider for a little bit, probably not long, and then climb in my pajamas and climb into bed, and hopefully I can get to sleep pretty quickly here, and also hopefully this headache goes away. I did finish invoicing too, so like I'm done work for the night, which is a good feeling. Alrighty, well it is the end of the night. The microphone is in the way again. Um, my headache is all but gone. It's just like tinged on the edge, but it's finally pretty much gone. I thought I would finish the night with some self-care. I did all my face stuff and now I put them in these eye patches, which I don't know if they do anything, but they feel so nice. <laughs> and I tidied up my room a little bit. I honestly, I don't even know how it gets to be such a mess. I think now that I'm getting clothes, like I mentioned the other day, I can't remember if it was yesterday or like the day before, where I just buy clothes because I'm like, yeah, that fits, it's cute. And then I buy in like five different colors. Well, now that I'm starting to actually buy clothes that I really like, instead of just yeah, acceptable. Um, I think we go through my closet again. Like I said earlier, I want to get rid of all my tank tops. Um, so that's probably going to be helpful because I have too many clothes. I mean, it's a thing. I like in the, in the hallway outside my room, there's like two small garbage bags of clothes that I've already pulled to get rid of that just haven't gone to donation yet. So yeah, anyways, I am almost done Iron Man 3. I have like half an hour left. I pretty much didn't embroider anymore because I was just like, ah, I'm over it and I stopped. And um, so now I'm just gonna chill for a bit. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna chill. I'm gonna finish watching this and slowly get myself sorted for tomorrow because I do have to work. So I need to pack my bag back up because it became a disaster, I'm not sure why. So yeah, I'm gonna go and I will see you in the next vlog whenever that appears because at this rate I think I'm like six edits behind. It'll be fine. <laughs> Good night.